Manchester United face Ajax in the Europa League final in Stockholm on Wednesday night. The biggest game that we've had in the last few years. And this season, towards the end of it, May and April, we've had a lot of players injured. We've had a lot of games in that time. And so many players have, have been injured, so many players have been rested. But who will Jose Mourinho start in this Europa League final? Here is my predicted 11 for the game itself. In goal, Sergio Romero. Now, there's been lots of debate about whether David De Gea should come back into the team. But Sergio Romero has not put a foot wrong in the Europa League this year. And I think Mourinho is going to reward him with a starting place out in Stockholm. Is that the right decision? We did a video about it earlier this week. Plenty of Reds debating. Make sure you leave your views on it in the comments. Now, at right back, Antonio Valencia. He's going to have a very busy game because Ajax have excellent wingers. And because they break with such pace, we're going to need Antonio Valencia's pace on the recovery to really make sure that our two centre-backs don't get exposed. Now, in the centre-back, I've gone for Daley Blind coming up against his former Ajax side. And I've gone for Phil Jones. I would rather see him start there than Chris Smalling, who this season has looked like Bambi on ice. I think Phil Jones has had a... He, alongside Marcus Rojo, I think it was early this season, prior to Jones getting injured, he showed some excellent form. And he played 90 minutes against Crystal Palace, and maybe that means he won't play, but I would much rather see Jones there alongside Blim because obviously Eric Bai is suspended. You idiot. Now, left back, I've gone for Matteo Darmian. Deventry Mitchell played excellently well against Crystal Palace, and I wouldn't be surprised to see him in the travelling squad for Stockholm, but I think he'll go back to his default, relying on his senior players. This is Mourinho. This is a European Cup final. Some stereotypes are going to be made true, and I think this is going to be one of them. So Darmian in at left back. Now, for a midfield two or three, I'm not really sure. I've gone for Pogba, Fellaini, and Herrera. I think Fellaini will start this game. Ajax, one of their weak points is certainly going to be deep free kicks into the box. They don't have a very tall team. Dolberg is over six foot. I think there's only one other player in there that's over six foot. They're a small side and that adds to their attacking fluidity and that's why they're so exciting going forward. But in defence, there's weaknesses that Man United can expose. And I see Fellaini's height as one of them and Mourinho will too. So don't be surprised to see Man United playing quite direct sort of negating the press, because if Ajax press with intensity in the middle and we skip that with balls over the top, they can't hurt us. But it depends whether or not Fellaini plays in a sort of deeper midfield role or in a number 10. Where would you rather see him play if he is going to start? So I've gone for Herrera, Pogba and Fellaini in the middle. And I've gone for a front three of Lingard, Rashford and Mkhitaryan. Now Mkhitaryan has been quite disappointing across the whole Premier League season, but his best form has come in the Europa League against European opposition. What, a first, what an end to the first season it will be for him if he can score the winner for Man United in the European Cup final. I hope he can. And Jesse Lingard, I'm definitely putting him in the team, will need his work rate and will need his pace up top, just like we did against Chelsea at home. I do feel we're going to be playing some of those direct balls over the top and trying to negate Ajax's press because that has been one of their assets this season. So if we can cut that out with balls over the top, why wouldn't we? And of course, Marcus Rashford leading the line. A Manchester born and bred academy youngster who has spearheaded us to this Europa League final with his goal against and elect an extra time, his free kick away at Celta Vigo. Rashford has stood up and made himself big and got the big goals where Man United have needed it in this build up to the final. Can he do it in Stockholm as well? United fans already love him, but if he can do that as well, he'll write himself into the folklore. Now, who would you start in this final? Are there any players there that you would switch in or out? Let me know in the comments below. But as I said, it's Man United's biggest game in the last few years. We can't afford not to win this, but Ajax are a very dangerous team. It's going to be tough, but I think this team here can do it.